Well, we're back here at the uh, Cave of Science, and we're going to look at how to process your video that you're uh, taking of your falling object. Uh, most of you are going to shoot it with a camera phone, and uh, very easily, and we've done this before, you can download the video uh, into your Google Drive app. And then from there, once it's in your drive, you've got to download it and drag it into your school folder. And we did this earlier in the year. And uh, once you have it in your school folder, then you can get to it for uh, the Logger Pro. So you're gonna need to open up uh, Logger Pro 3.1, <coughs> excuse me, 3.15, which should be on your desktop of the laptop. All right, so we are going to go to File, and we want, oop, wrong one. We're gonna go Insert, and Movie, and then you, you get your school folder will show up here and you'll pick it out of there. And mine is in the desktop. <clears throat> and then I'm going to open it up. And it's loading, loading, loading. And you can see I have my video here. Now, if you find that your video is uh, rotated 90 degrees, we can take care of that rather easily. So, first thing, if you remember right, lower bottom right hand corner, the three dots and you'll come up with a bunch of uh, stuff over here. First thing we want to do is set the Y and the X axis. And if we click here, you're going to find it's there. Now, what we need to do though, we need to rotate this. And instead of rotating it counterclockwise, we're going to grab the ball and we are going to rotate it clockwise and we want to get it to line up there we go it looks pretty good to be a straight shot there so we're gonna have a y velocity and we want our y velocity uh, numbers to be positive uh, if you remember we need to set our scale and that's why we have the meter stick in the background and we'll set that and it's gonna be one unit so we're all set now next, before we start plotting points, I would suggest you move the frames until the ball starts to drop, like maybe right there. Because otherwise, you've got this much time, you're just going to have a bunch of uh, dots just moving all over. If you remember, when you start clicking on this, make click the same point. I'm going to try to hit the center of the ball for all my points. You know, if you're going to click the front of it or you're going to click the rear of it, just be consistent. So we go up here. we got to go to the second one from the top. Add point. And I'm going to start adding my points. And you can see as we're doing this, the ball is dropping. Notice the Y velocities are positive. is what we want. And again, try to get it right in the center of mass. And let's see if we can do this here. Get it all the way down to the... And a little tough there, but I'm going to probably call, do one more. And I'm going to call that good. <clears throat> so we got X velocity, which we really don't care about. We have Y velocity. And if you move the slider over, it's got some other stuff. But it also has time, which we're going to need. So it looks like we got some pretty good data here. So at this point, you can go to File, Export As, and we want to export it as a CSV. And this will save into your school folder. And the file name, I'm just going to call this uh, object one. And I'm going to save mine in my desktop. Again, you would save it in your school folder. And I'm going to go ahead and save that. So that's how you get your or analyze your video. So I'm going to end this video right here. And then uh, the second one will be how to uh, operate the video put it into your Google Drive and what to do from there. All right, so that's it from the Cave of Science right now and we'll talk to you again in a few minutes.